About a month ago, I was having some plumbing issues at home, so I called my cousin, Latasha. And I told Latasha if I could ask her if I could stay with her until I got my plumbing situation under control because there was a really bad sewer smell coming from out of the basement and I didn't want to, I didn't want to be there. And she said yes. So I was going back and forth um, between Tasha's house and my house because I needed to check on the plumbing uh, concerns that were there. So I was just you know, going by my day and then Latasha called me and asked me did I take any money from her. She asked me because when we were kids um, there was a history of theft with me uh, when I was a kid. I was probably one of the first person she would accuse because of that. But I told her, the first person I thought that probably could have took her money was David, which is her boyfriend. I think David took her money because David is very manipulative. David is very controlling. David is very quiet. Uh, it's just something about him that I believe that he's the one that took Latasha's money. They're having money issues. He's not going to work. I don't think he's going to work because because I have my reasons. Steve, I don't know what the hell she's talking about, but um, we never had a money issue, you know, until I allowed her to come to my home. So were you close with your cousin? We had difficulties, you know, because, you know, and like her, like she said, in her, in her past, she is a thief. And once Steve, you know, always a thief always going to be a thief. So if you're letting a known thief stay with you, wouldn't no, you make Steve, sure you really, like, hide that money very well? I, I did hide it very, to me I did, because yeah. first she, like, I, I work in and out, you know, and, you know, she had helped me at times to be there with my kids, and I believe the day I went to work, that's when she was in there rumbling. She went, you had in your bedroom somewhere? Yeah, I had it hidden in my bedroom. Where'd you have it hidden in your bedroom? Under the bed, it's like a little hole. So she must have, like I said, she had it been really rumbling. You How know? did you discover that the money was gone? Because I pay my rent every month on the 20th. And last week, I was trying to go pay it early. And now I decide, now I see that my money was gone. And she already had moved out Yeah, she point? was already gone. I asked all my, my kids, and I, and I even called David. I said, David, you know, did you um, move the money? You know what I'm saying? Which he didn't even know where my money was at. Right. Uh, then that's when it made me call Nia. And then she, she went to a defense real fast, like calling me all out my name and, you know. Nia's here. She took a lie detector test. What if she fails for stealing your money? She gonna have to pay that back today. Because yeah. I don't have nowhere to go. Listen, Tasha. Only thing I can tell you is that you are not gonna accuse me of doing something that happened that of you, no, you no, accusing no. me of a reputation that happened to me when I was a kid. Okay? No, Lania. You cannot accuse how could, me. How could you even do how how could you even do your cousins and them like that? I wouldn't even do that to you. The thing is, you need to check the people that's in your household. Lania, you was the only person there, you and the baby. I was, right. That's not I'm a woman of integrity. No, I don't no, have that's not even only, me anymore. You was the only person that's there. not even me anymore. I don't steal. That's not me anymore. That was me when I was a kid. No, you I got, don't do No, Lania, fact, you even got you even got no, I had a, we had a relative that taught me how to steal when I was a kid. I was about four or five years old. I know that David probably took your money because... So you're saying you didn't take the money? No, I didn't take the money. David took did her you, money. And you... I got a reason why I think David took why her money. Why is the reason? Right. And the, re and the reason why, because she, Tasha doesn't even know the reason. But said that he saw David come in the house and with a couple of bags, he said it looked like mall bags, it looked like some clothes or some shoes, a couple of boxes of shoes was in it. So that's how I know. For the fact that I, I know I didn't steal the money and I know that David had to because, I mean, it's obvious. She let's, told... meet, let's meet David. Let's bring okay. David out. You know, you know you uh, took her money. Uh, you took on. her money. Don't play me. You took her I money. Take care I know you I did. I take care of her. I done took care of you. I don't care about nothing but my kids. You lay, you lay next to her. Look, yeah, because that's my woman. I so don't you care about you. So you probably took her money because you knew that there was a background behind for me. Man, look, I, I didn't care so, about so nothing. That, that's so like that, that's what it Period. is. That's what it is. I just want my David, money. David, David, did you, did you steal the money? Man, the, I paid the money. What I want to steal it for? Right. <laughs> So she brings up the point that uh, after the money was stolen that you seemed to go on a shopping spree. I work. Yeah. I'm supposed to take care of myself. Ain't nobody else going to do it. Right. You need I'm going to take care of this man. Uh, you need to take care of this man. Anybody you think know. David stole the money? No. I'm going to take care of this family too long, man. Uh-uh, no. <laughs>
Not a lot of people think you stole the money, David. We asked David, did you take any of Latasha's missing $625? You answered no. Do you know if for took any of Latasha's missing $625? You answered no. The results came back the same to each of those questions, and it came back that David told the truth. Yeah. You better pay my money. You better have yeah, my whatever. money. I'm whatever. Who thinks Nia took the money? Hey! hey. See, that's not even in me, Steve. That, see, that's not. No. So Nia came here, she took the lie detector test, and we asked her, did you take any of Latasha's missing $625? She answered no. Do you know for sure who took any of Latasha's missing $625? She answered no. The results came back the same to each of those questions, and it came back that Nia told the truth. Yeah. Oh! So somebody else, so somebody else, somebody else took your uh, money. What you got us both sitting out here? David, you got us both, you got us both out here looking stupid because you don't know where your money's at. You don't know who you letting in your house. I know you're in a little bit of shock because you did believe that Nia took the money, but don't you owe her an apology? I do. I'm sorry. I called the show today because my boyfriend, Prince, that I've been with 18 years, I'm thinking has been sleeping with coworkers, friends, I done caught him on social media, and also I feel like he's sleeping with one of my family members. It's getting to the point where I can't go to work, when I go to work, I think about what he's doing. I keep catching him do this and that. I go through his phone. I'm tired of doing it. One day I come home, I seen him come in the bathroom, and I'm asking him what he's taking a shower for. You already took one early before I went to work, but then you turn around, you taking another one? I go through Facebook. I see him talking to another girl on there. I ask him about it. He sits there and denies it. I'm like, OK, I see it. Next thing you know, the app going off your phone. So obviously, you cheating. I feel like he's messing with one of my family members because they got too close to each other. They sit in my living room and they always eyeballing each other. I was at work, I got home early one day to catch them just sitting there talking and he got on his underwear. Have you been cheating on her? No sir, I haven't. Not recently. I mean, like years ago, you know what I mean? Yeah, because you guys been together a long time. Yeah, like 17 years. Do you so. still talk to women on social media now? Um, no. Not at all. Not at all. Not here. Not, not recently. You know what I mean? Not recently. Like the last couple days. No. No, this may be like a couple months ago. Then she caught me doing it though. You see what I'm saying? What, so did, I can't... what did she catch you doing? I mean, you know, she she found a face. She found, you know, I had woke up. Like she always kept like I'm waking up. Like she always wakes me up to it. It's like I can't come home from work and she did. It's like boom, it's three, four in the morning. What's this in your phone? You know, I'm like, oh man, you know what I'm saying? And so, what was it? It was just like she saw where I was, you know, talking to someone that I knew. We was relaying messages and stuff like that. But that's all it was, though. It didn't nothing happen after that. It was that, but it was the content of the messages sexual? No. 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 No, sir. Um, and then she says you hide apps on your phone. Man. <laughs> Man. I, it's not literally hiding, OK? When I was you know, slipping up, I call it slipping up, I would shoot a message to somebody, and then I'd take it off my phone. You see Because you were hiding stuff from her. Well, yeah, 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 you can say yeah. that. You can say that. You can say that. And can say that. why were you hiding it from her? Because I knew I was wrong. Yeah. You know, it's wrong, you know what I'm saying? Because I love this woman. We've been together 17 years. You know, our oldest boy is 16 years old, you see what I'm saying? So, you know, I... I really didn't know what love was until I found her, you know what I'm saying? But, you know, it's like, here lately, man, I just been focused on her, but she don't believe me, so, you know. And uh, you're sleeping with one of her family members? No, I'm not. No, I'm not. I mean, you know, my own family thinking this stuff. You see oh, what I'm really? saying? Yeah, see, I mean, they don't think it, but when I told them about it, they're like, did you do it? Like, hey, yeah. for real? I'm your, your so family. They know, so they know you, though? Yeah, they, they know me. You know you lying. I done caught you on social media plenty of times. Oh, you gonna sit man. up here and lie? Man, you gonna, you gonna do lie? This? You gonna do this right no, now? No, seriously, because I'm tired of all of this. You gonna do like, this? you sit here and you do this every time. 
You guys been together a really long time. Why, why didn't you ever get married? I'm not marrying him until I know how, no, I don't believe, I don't she know. She shot me doing, down so many I times, sure man. What if he passes hurt. his lie detector test Oh, today? yeah, well then. Then the wedding's on. Oh, yeah, I'll be happy. Thank what you. if he fails? Is it really over? I am done. Really? I'm done. I'm done. I'm done. Especially man, with my I family. Will, I'm man. not. I'm I, not you can't work none out people. like it. I'm not sleeping now, with people, Now, co-workers, man. I can, uh, I can if adjust If it's a co-worker, somebody else. They all scared of me, so I ain't worried about it. Because uh, I pops up at the job, honey. Right. <laughs> I done yeah, done it three or four times. Yeah, she done done that too many times. And so, I'm getting tired of that, too. But see, I, I don't know. I could mm -hmm. be wrong. But I, got I think I got Prince that. is telling the truth. Who thinks Prince is telling the truth? Thank you, thank you, thank you. Really? Thank you, thank you. Less than half. Way up there, thank you. Thank you. Less, less than that. Most people think you're cheating. I'm a good guy. Like the Prince took a lie detector test, and we asked him, since December of 2013, have you had sexual physical contact with any other female besides Delicia? He answered no. Since December of 2013, have you had sexual intercourse with any other female besides Delicia? He answered no. Have you ever had any type of sexual activity, contact, or intercourse with Delicia's family member? He answered no. Since December of 2013, have you had any type of sexual activity, contact, or intercourse with any of your female co-workers? No. Nope. He answered no. The results came back all the same, and it came back that Prince told the truth. Huh? Click here to watch more Wilco's. Click here to subscribe and get a front row seat for all the action. Can you relate to this story? Go to www.stewilcos.com to get my help.